The phase diagram shows the possible phases of tungsten carbide as a function of the atom percent of carbon. The different phases bond with different stoichiometric ratios and therefore differ in crystal structure. We will examine the delta phase, which forms a very thin strip along the 50 atom percent line, due to its simpler lattice structure and varied applications. The phase is paratectic, forming as a mixture of solid carbon and liquid solution cools. The crystal structure of tungsten carbide is classified as hexagonal. The structure is prone to point defects, which occur when carbon and tungsten atoms swap places or when a vacancy forms. The way that the most compact crystals of tungsten carbide are formed is through a process called sintering. Sintering requires that powders of both tungsten and carbon are pre-mixed and heated together at very high temperatures. The metal tungsten and the non-metal carbon form triple bonds with each other to form tungsten carbide. These bonds, which are technically metallic bonds, behave covalently, giving the material ceramic properties. The strength and stiffness of triple bonds give the material excellent mechanical properties. Tungsten carbide is one of the highest melting compounds known to science. Its melting point at eutectic proportions, which have the lowest melting points, are in excess of 2700 degrees Celsius, and some compositions can remain partially solid at temperatures higher than 3000 degrees Celsius. On the surface of the sun, where most materials exist as plasma, tungsten carbide would not even boil. Tungsten carbide also has high density, toughness, strength, thermal and electrical conductivity, and is resistant to almost all acids. The material is, however, very brittle and has a low ductility. As with all crystals, tungsten carbide's lattice is riddled with defects. Both carbon and tungsten can have vacancies, interstitials, and antisites, which is when both atoms swap places. Carbon is a lot smaller and lighter than tungsten, so it takes less energy to move carbon atoms out of place. Carbon defects are therefore far more frequent. High carbon mobility also means a high diffusivity of carbon in the lattice, usually via the energetically favorable basal octahedral site. These imperfections distort the lattice, making it much more difficult for layers of atoms to slip past each other, so the crystal remains rigid even under intense stress. Tungsten carbide has numerous uses, the most common being in industrial appliances. Its high strength, hardness, and toughness means it is often the material of choice for drill bits, mill parts, and picks. As of recently, it has also been showing up in jewelry, because it is much cheaper than gold and is extremely lustrous when polished.